Charles IV, King of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor, had a long and successful reign. The empire he ruled from Prague expanded, and his subjects lived in peace and prosperity. When the emperor died, the whole empire mourned. More than 7,000 people accompanied him on his last procession. Oh, shit. The heir to the throne of the flourishing empire was Charles' son, Wenceslas IV, whose father had prepared him for this moment all his life. But Wenceslas did not take after his father. He neglected affairs of state for more frivolous pursuits. Of course. He even failed to turn up for his own coronation as emperor, which did little wow. to endear him to the Pope. <laughs> Wenceslas the Idol did not impress the imperial nobility either. His difficulties mounted until the nobles, exasperated by the inaction of their ruler, turned for help to his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary. His half-brother? Sigismund decided on a radical solution. He kidnapped the king to force him to abdicate, then took advantage of the ensuing disorder to gain greater power for himself. He invaded Bohemia with a massive army and began pillaging the territories of the king's allies. It is here that my story begins. Oh. So the half-brother took the throne. Jon Snow shit. Okay, let's see what we got here. I remember this game looked like shit on stream, by the way. HD textures unavailable? Wait, was there an uh, HD texture pack? Bruh, What the fuck? There is? You can download it? There's screen tearing? Relax, dude. I gotta change the settings. Is it DLC you download? Alright, fine. Maybe I'll get all the DLC for the game. Alright, I think we're ready to go. All the DLCs are good. KCD's story is long. How long is this playthrough? Seventy fucking hours? Yeah, I don't know if we're gonna beat this. This needs to be crazy, and you guys don't have the attention span. You can talk shit all you want, bro. I saw, I saw who showed up during the Final Fantasy 16 playthrough. I saw. Armored Core, it ain't worth it. All right, here we go. Ultra high, laud distance. Turn everything up, sound settings. I don't think I need to turn anything else on. Wait, is this company owned by Embracer Group? Oh, no. No, these are ready to play. I don't think I have to turn the DLCs on. HD textures are on. Literally everything's on. Relax. Hardcore mode is literally hardcore. Like, you die, right? One tap? The early 15th century was a time of turmoil in the Holy Roman Empire, which had flourished under the late Emperor Charles IV, but now with his son, Wenceslas, the idol rip, the king's inactivity angered many of the nobility, as well as his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary, who decided to take drastic steps to restore power to Europe. That's what that beginning cinematic was. That was the TLDR.
reminds me of building like a manor lord village. in the mine. Okay, yo, it's a nice place. Nice little fucking... Nice little town to live in. Imagine this, but an MMO. Well, husband, how goes it? Good. I should get it finished today. Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. He was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour? Blue-blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, drinking like a lord. <laughs> Go and get the lazy bones up then. <laughs> Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. Ugh, before Fortnite. Henry! Get up now. There's work to be done. Get up or I'll come get you up, you slugger Hear that? You'd better not vex him. Get up! Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You'd better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Oh, don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself, is all. Hmm. Well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Henry! Now get up, you rogue. <sighs> Damn. He's in that level one gear. Linen, linen cloth. Oh, shit. A fine state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? Oh, my God. Um, I was working in the forge. I was dancing. I was with Bianca. We were chatting in the tavern. Fuck, I gotta make choices here. Vitality, agility, strength. Let's go agility. I was dancing. I went dancing. Dancing? With Bianca. Ah, that's why you're tired. But you'll still have to work today. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand. I and leveled up. suspicious looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. Why would I be interested in sword fighting? Matthias was teaching me archery. I was with Bianca. What does it matter? What does it matter? So I'm learning to sword fight. And what of it? What harm does it do? At least I'll be able to defend myself. God above, Hal. You know how your father will react when he finds out. How? What's he going to do? I'm doing nothing wrong. I just wanted to try it. On your own head be it then. I can't stop you. And you can deal with your father on your own. Don't come looking to me for help. Whoa, I'm hungry. Can I get something to eat? I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. All right, we're good. 
Is Pa angry? I'm good. We're good. All right. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, yo. Okay. Nice house. Oh, yeah. This game still looks pretty damn great. Eat from pot. Delicious. To eat food. Eye for inventory. Oh, my God. This is the guy. Green shirt. Trunk keys. Oh, leg plate, gloves, okay, I see, helmet, head chain mill, coif, neck chain, all right, all right, sure, health, energy, player, main level, strength, more info, okay, oh, this is a whole thing, huh, um, speed and movement, show less, I don't think I can level up. It says main level. Oh, okay. So I get like different shit. Okay, this just shows different stuff that happens. I think I get these as I put more shit into defense. Alright, nice. We're good. Alright, we already ate. I guess I'm gonna leave. Open. Nice. You can up strength. Oh, wait, yeah, that means I can up it. Oh, that means I can pick a perk. Carrying dead blocking an opponent strike with your shield will cost you less stamina. Maximum level 4, maximum level 2. Uh, I guess stronghold? Oh, shit, alright. Is this the fucking pantry? Apple, take all. Alright. I'm on an apple diet. Officially on an apple diet. And cheese. Apple, cheese, and all that stuff. And corn. Alright. Oh, damn, yo. Go to Fatar. Fatar. I have awoken, father. Yo, nice. Yeah, I mean, shit, it's a good looking game, yo. At least you're up, that's a start. Anyway, we have a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money then. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh? Not drunkard? <laughs> that'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. Sure I'll be happy to hear it. Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sasau. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. Damn! Oh, you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now, work won't wait. Run along new! Alright, let's see here. We got a bunch of fucking quests. God damn it. Bunch of damn quests. Hey, Dev. Hey, Dev. Oh, he put it down. He heard me. What was the point of this small pile? What are you even doing? Oh, wait. He, he picked it back up. He picked it back up. Hey, Dev. Damn. Nice. Oh, shit, man. God save him. This is nice, dude. Good day, Henry. 
Oh, I'm known. Oh, this game. Oh my god. I the 4090 is not keeping up. I'm at 90 FPS in this shit. Ah right, yeah, where's my quest log? Let me see. Quest log A B C. Is this an order? Buy bag. Go to the sword. Fighting lesson. Collect the debt from Kunesh. All right, let's go get go to Kunesh first. Yeah. Oh my. Yo, this shit is not fucking doing it. All right, we gotta collect the money from this guy. Kunesh. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? What do you want? Father sent me. My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Whoa! Pay the lot or else. I knew you'd be trouble. Father says if you don't pay up, he'll come here himself and hammer those nails into your hairy ass. I'd like to see you try. Fuck off, you bastard, or your old man will be pulling those nails out of you. Oh my fucking god, chill. Am I about to fucking... This is chat, this is what you guys type. I am not reading all that. Debt debts must be paid. Oh, okay, okay, I see. You can expect a visit from father. Debts must be paid, YOLO. Look. I know things aren't easy. Your wife ran off. Booze is dear these days, and you're as much use as a square wheel. It's no wonder you're short of coin. Damn! A debt, and I can't leave here without something. You son of a whore! How dare you speak Fail. to me like that? Can <laughs> your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Take care. Uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> Hook, jab, kick, lock on, unlock, block. All right. You're dumb shit. <laughs> Yo, this guy's so good at dodging. Ow! What the fuck? What's up, man? Back the fuck up. Back the fuck up. There it is. There it is. Ah! Ah! You're going to cry now. What's up, man? You're gonna cry, man. Pay Your up. Feet. Pay up. Ah. Ow! Yo, this lock-on is a little trippy. Ow! Jesus. I blocked, I blocked. All right, relax, relax, buddy. We're comboing. Ow! Dude, how much H- it. How much HP does this guy have? Wait. Shit. Triple block. That's insane. You're done for, bastard. Oh wait, do you block with? Oh, you do. I don't know if your block direction matters. Shit. Yeah, let me pick up his axe. He's open. Okay. I can't hit this guy anymore. Dude, I can't hit this guy anymore. He's dodging everything. Oh wait, I won. Uh, I give up. Take what you want. It's not much, but it's all I have. You understand? And find something. He gave me a key. 
And then he's going back. Easy. Find something at Kunax worth shelling. Kunesh's. Let's take his axe. Yoink. I think he gave me a key to his house. I'm not sure if this was... I just kind of went right through into his front door. I don't know if we want to eat what he has, but why not? Oh, here we go. Kunesh's hammer and his nails. Try to get the axe hammer and nails back another way. Okay, well, he never used them. Collect debt from Kunesh. All right, we, we're good. What is this? All right. We're going to take his house. All right, that's everything. Yeah, this game kind of chugs at times. Maxed out on this computer. Everything turned up. Take a shit in his bed. Go to sword fighting, buy a bag of charcoal, pick up the cross guard, buy ale at the tavern, pick up the cross guard at the castle. All right, let's go. We could go to training. I'm glad you stopped by. Yeah, what if we just go to training first at B? Yes, let's go to sword training. Hey, Pip. Do you want to learn something? Oh, this guy. No. Have you recovered from yesterday's great wound? Oh, it was nothing. It was Except nothing. mother noticed and had a word or two to say about it. No mother's happy when a son starts to take an interest in swords. Where there's weapons, there's death. The question is, what do you want? I don't want to rot in this hole forever. I feel like I don't belong here. I want to live and see the world. But the world's a dangerous place and I need to know how to protect myself. Spoken like a man. And as it happens, today's your last chance. I have to leave. So, are you ready what? to get stuck in? Yes. Let's go. All right. I wait on the ground by the sheepfold as usual. Okay. Is this guy still assigned? Oh, okay. He's... All right. I'm just going to follow you. I have nothing else to do. Oh, my God, dude. The horse just, like, boofed me. Combat Master, what's his name? Vanyek? Shit. Alright, let's go, man. Turn down LOD. Yeah, maybe maxed out LOD is what fucks your FPS. Alright, dude. Here we go. I guess I could have went and sold shit, but I'd rather just follow this guy and do the sword stuff. Oh, those are the sheep right there as well. Shit. Chat, if we grew up during these times, we'd all be fucked. We're all fucking brain rotted. We need electronics. We need electronics to function. Alright. Alright, what's up, man? So, can we get started? Yeah, dude. That's why I walked with you. We can. We can. Good. And since today's the last time we'll be seeing each other, you can show me everything I've taught you so far. Okay, this guy's acting like we're okay. We're never gonna Stop see each other. Basics. Keep moving. Your life depends on it. You can move out. Right you can unlock from your opponent with left shift. Uh, anytime by holding left shift. Oh, okay. So auto lock. All right. Locks. All right. Now try to hit me. You have to put your weight into your attack. If you just fiddle around. Chat. One second. This game feels fucked. I think it might be because I'm playing borderless. It's when I move my mouse, it doesn't feel like it's working correctly. Try slashing from different sides. Mm. Unpredictability is the key. Never repeat yourself. Fine. Now you're getting it. 
Now you're getting it. Very good. Not bad. Again. The point of the blade is for stabbing. Try it a few times. How do I stab? Oh, stab, weak attack? Oh, good. Once again. You can stab from different All angles. Right. Very good. Good, good. Let's try something else. One strike, I can fend off without a sweat. But if you chain your strikes, I'll have a much harder time. As soon as you land one blow, follow it with another. Okay, T try to press. A, a, a previous strike lands. Oh, I see. You just have to hope your stamina keeps up, though. All right. Oh, God, I'm fucking... Oh, God. God damn, this wooden sword. Chill, dude. Holy fuck, buddy. Relax. Relax. We're training, bro. We're training, dude. Relax. Holy shit. Fine. Fine. That's enough. What? I don't know about you, but I'm tired of thirsty. What? Remember, though, train hard. No one becomes a master swordsman overnight. You have to work and work. And the main thing is to use what you've learned in real combat. There's nothing better than experience, believe me. Dude, it's been like five minutes. I'm never going to see you again. Sensei. It's like, fuck you, man. Bye. All right, where are we going next here? Good day, Henry. Good day, good day. Everyone's so nice in this village. Okay, let's go pick up the cross guard at the castle. Welcome, Henry. Welcome. Lady, I literally have been here for like 20 years. I live up the hill. What do you mean, welcome? All right, we gotta pick up a cross guard for a sword being constructed by my dad. Hey! What up? Wait, am I going the wrong way? No, this is the right way, I'm pretty sure. I'll be with you. I'm with you, Henry. How are you? Father sent me. We're forging a sword for Sir Radzig, and the Chamberlain has the cross guard and grip. Father had them engraved in Sassau. Right. They're here. The Chamberlain gave them to us for you. We looked them over. Beautiful work. I've never seen anything so fine. I can't wait to see the sword. Just make sure you don't botch it. When did I ever botch anything? Where shall I start? Ah, shut up and give me what I want, or I'll kick your ass this evening. Right away, your lordship. This fucking Magnificent. guy. Magnificent. Shame I can't keep the sword for myself. Well, I'd better go if we're to get the job done by this evening. Godspeed. See you later in the tavern. You certainly will. After today's work, the ale might even be on me. Oi, the ale! Pick up the cross guard at the castle. Oh, he gave it to me, lol. Oh, J for journal. Okay, let's go buy uh, charcoal. Is that a Christmas edition? Christian Bale? Nice. Oh yeah, dude, I finally started watching Oppenheimer yesterday. Hey, Henry's come to see us. Oh my God, this guy. Master charcoal salesman. Good health to you. Started? Yeah, um, I didn't finish it in one go, bro. I'm gonna finish it tonight. Let's talk trade. Alright, Charcoal, how much gold do I have? Zero gold. I'm assuming I'm selling shit to buy this. Am I right? Add to basket? Check basket. I will say, this menu's ridiculous. You pay- Can we do something about the price? 
Aye. Aye. Yeah, the menu is fucking ridiculous. You can haggle, make, offer. Hey, yo, how do I sell shit? Rep lost? Dude, okay. Like, I give a fuck. Like, I give a fuck what you want. What the hell is this? Don't I need to go sell? I have to sell shit. Up is buy and sell. Can, can he? Does he? Hold on. Oh, wait, right here. Okay, I think I'm doing this right. Close the deal. Oh, I had. I'd like to discuss the price. Why not? Selling quest items? I thought he said he gave the nails and the hammer to Kunesh, and then Kunesh was going to give him money. So instead, we have no gold. Okay, whatever. Apparently, I'm wrong. I'm going to sell some other shit. Uh, the reds. Okay, these are expensive. I'm going to sell my pants. Okay, and my fucking scarf. All right, mom can sew another one. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, I'm sure that I'm uh, gonna win or lose. All right, I think that's enough for charcoal. Goodbye. Sage. All right, eleven gold. How much is this? Check basket. Oh, yo, wait, it was cheap as fuck. It was so cheap. It was point five gold. Alright, last thing I need is ale from Bianca. I just ripped the playthrough. That guy's actually the fucking bastard son. He's actually the true heir to the throne. He's gonna remember that. Come right up and take some home. Buddy, relax. Implements, instruments, and tools. Everything for work and home. Rakes and hose for your field. What else do you need? Come on up and see. God damn, not wrong. Hey, yo, where is the entrance to this shit? Oh, right here? Oh, whoa. You can't be serious, Deutsch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. I had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts? Traitor. Now even the Pope God be with is you, opposed Henry. to your king. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsch is spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear Yo, for Yo, no politics when we drink, Some man. Has to bring order. And reunite the empire. <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander in chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you, Talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund. And don't and forget about Gutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words exactly. Come on, man. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Read it in 1558. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson, doesn't he, Fritz? You too, I might view. Should give him a proper hiding. Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit. It made me think of that huge pile of manure. You know. 
The one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather torch it, to be honest. But doing some turds will do. Oh my what do you god. Say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for father and a, a few other things. Come on, man. We're finishing Saratic Sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? Come on, man. This is where the everything goes to shit. I won't do it. I won't. Fine. Oh, well. Father can wait a while. <laughs> My words exactly. I knew you wouldn't miss out on all the fun. Let's go. All right, the boys. The old crew. Damn, look at the distance, the forest. Shit, man. Oh yeah, this is it. I hear, oh yeah. Is this his house? Discuss the plan of attack. What up, dude? So are we doing this or not? Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? The Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go and lure her away somehow. Why me? Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. Bro, all the NPCs know me. What do you want, lad? I just went by the tavern, and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right, and King Wenceslas is a drunkard. That sort of thing. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty, the fool. Next thing he'll start on about the Popes. Oh. He might have mentioned the Popes too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. Easy. Easy. Oh shit. Wait, reputation lost. Come on, man. What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For king and country! For king and country, my ass! This is all good, clean, fun! <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund! This is definitely the calm before the storm. Shit, you bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> hey, hands! Can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Horse hunt! Let's make those smites off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. Oh. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy Deutsche? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, they're instigating. Fuck her! I'll make you pay for that! Go and get revenge on Dutch. Hey, hold on, hold on. Everybody relax. Everybody relax. Wait, is this a... Alright, I'll help. I'll, yeah, I got this guy. This guy. For God's sake! Yo! Right now. Pay attention to me! On his way. Let's go. Run from the catch run, pole? You coward. Oh. And we better fucking run too. Run, guys! Run! What are you doing? We don't have to run. They didn't run. We had to run. 
Oh, this is a fast travel How point? How are you, Henry? Oh, there's a path here. Mm. Oh, that was my friend? <laughs> home guys peace father's gonna be pissed all right let's go home greetings Henry greetings Henry I still need the ale right I never made it into the actual bar meet the lads at Kunesh's Wash your hands first. Are you being serious? All right. Oh, Bianca. Hey, yo, we need ale. God save my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? You do? Your beauty, of course. Of course. <laughs> oh, noble sir. I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And... Apart from my beauty, what else might your worship desire? Um, a pitcher for father. A ale for father. A pitcher as usual? Aye. Bring me a cool one from the cellar. <laughs> but of course. Nice. Hey, well. Thanks. It's on me today. <laughs> You can pay me back this evening. Out of the question. Here you go. And this evening I'll have something more for you. <laughs> I can't wait. Thanks. Oh. You'll have something to look forward to this evening. Jack, close your eyes. <laughs> you too. Oh, um, by the way, that shifty looking fellow was asking after you. Vanyak. I suppose. He's a man who makes his coin robbing honest wayfarers. I'm sure of it. I'll be happy when he's gone for good. But what in heaven's name are you up to with him? He promised to teach me how to use a sword. What use would that be to you? Enough. You sound just like father. I'll be going now. See you this evening. Hal, I've got something special for you. Is that so? Now what would that be? Your favorite, Savior Schnapps. Really? You're an angel. <laughs> I hope you'll thank me properly later. You bet I will. Save your schnapps. You bet I will. Alright, yo, hold on. Meet the lads. Goddamn fucking lads, dude. Let me go meet the lads. Why are they at Kunesh's? The lads! Welcome, the lads! Well, we sorted that Deutsch out. <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? Hey, yo, I like that song. Oh, bastard didn't stand a chance. True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. Well, let him. Then I'll snitch on him. And anyway, what can they do to us for throwing a bit of dung? Good point. It's not as if anyone really likes the Deutsch. Nice job on the Deutsch's place. Anyway. Nice job at the Deutsches. Never a dull moment with you lot. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go back. Dad's gonna kick my ass. He's been waiting for this charcoal for a long time. Hey, sorry. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yo. Damn. All right, let me talk to him. About time. Have you got everything I wanted? Yes. 
Start I forging. I have charcoal, the hilt, and the ale. We can start. Good job. Let's have it then, son. Well done. Right. Let's see what kind of job the master in Sasal did for us. <laughs> Look at that lad. Well, that's what I call craftsmanship. What does the inscription mean? Damn if I know. Doesn't look like Czech to me. Latin, maybe? Lord Radzig ordered it. Oh, this will be the finest sword I've ever made. Have we got the charcoal? Good. And fire up the forge. We'll put it all together. Oh shit, the cross guard. By the way, someone paid me a call. I reckon you might know what it was about. I'm not sure. Really? Because I'm pretty sure you and your friends threw dung at Deutsch's freshly whitewashed house. What? He was here with the catchpole earlier, and it was not a friendly visit. What got into you, Hal? Oh, no. That Deutsch was talking treason in the tavern about Sigismund and the king. He got what he deserved. Got what he deserved, did he? You can go and clean up the mess you made and apologize to him. I have a trade to run. The German pays well. And having my son in the pillory helps nothing and nobody, least of all the king. You understand? Yes. Look me in the eye, Henry. Do you understand? I understand. Damn. Good. And we'll never have this conversation again. So you think it's right to let traitors speak ill of our king? <laughs> the boy gets caught making a fool of himself and he still hasn't learned his lesson. So Deutsch spouts rubbish and what? You turn into a common thug. You might win a fight with violence, but you'll never win an argument. Remember, Henry, if you want to convince someone that they're wrong, Try using your mouth and not your fists. Oh, Dad. The furnace is ready. He's right. right. We'll do the grip. I'll heat it up, and when I take it out, you slip the grip on so it fits exactly. You know what you're doing. Oh shit. Do it. The cross guard. Oh, yeah. Good. Once more. Yo, does he have That's gloves it. on? Done. Now file it down so it sits well in the hand. I'll prepare the guard. Father, why did you leave Prague? Who ever heard of a master swordsmith making horseshoes in a village? <laughs> I had my reasons, Hal. And here I have your mother and you. Why would I want any other life? Do you remember Emperor Charles? I do. Life was good under his reign. Better than now. He built half of Prague and a score of castles. Had a bridge made over the Moldau and founded a university. And all without a war. He knew how to rule. Better than Wenceslas. Better by far. Yeah, but this Wenceslas reminds me of a movie. Doesn't have it easy. It's hard it's to the step into it's the, the shoes setup. of someone whose like is born only once a thousand years. What about Sigismund? Do you think Charles would have brought an army down on his own people like Sigismund? No. Wenceslas may not be the equal of his father, but Sigismund, he brings shame to the royal name. How's it going? Give it here, and we'll put it all together. 
Oh, shit. It's a nice sword, man. It's magnificent. Indeed it is. The Lord be with you. My father sent me for those nails. Good day to you, Teresa. They're ready. Will you fetch them for me, Hal? They're in the trunk in the living room. They're in the trunk. <laughs> All right, let's move. <clears throat> Just looking out the window. Alright, nails for take all. Ah, I have big pockets. I think I have to sleep to get my HP back, right? Drop into pot. What the fuck? Apple. God damn it, son. Alright, me lord. Me papa. Me Henry, papa. What are you waiting for? Here are those nails, nails you wanted. Oh. Thanks. So, how's Bianca? Um, she's fine. Why do you ask? Just wondering. Will you be going to the dance this evening? We will. Henry, what are you Maybe waiting we'll see for? each other there. Those nails. Anyway, mustn't keep you. I'll be on my way. That sword is truly beautiful. Oh, shit. Fine lass, eh? Now stop staring at her and come and see this. It's time for the trial by fire. Hey, yo, Bianca saw that. Damn! Yo! <laughs> we did a fine job. I would expect nothing less from such a renowned swordsmith. Well, those days are gone, sir. Hmm. You haven't lost your skills, though. Would you like to try it? Sir, what good is a sword to a commoner? try it. What the hell? Oh, he didn't even you try. Still have a lot to learn. Ask your father to show you how. He knows what he's about. Learning his trade will serve him better in life, sir. Perhaps. But who knows what the future holds for each of us. I see that you almost have it finished. It just needs a polish, then Henry will bring it to you. Excellent. Fine work. Very fine. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. What say you say, Svan? True, Sir Radzik. If I'd have had its like back in Nicopolis, things would have worked out differently. How odd to find such an accomplished swordsmith working in a place like this. A man of his talent would have no problem making a fortune in Prague or Vienna. You're right. It's a very long and peculiar story. I'd be glad to listen to it over a cup of wine, but duty calls and I must leave. Here you are. Damn, the dad. Learn from your father. He truly is a master of his craft. I'm sure our paths will cross again. They certainly will. Once it's ready, send your son up to me with it. Good work, Martin. Sure. Sure. It's been an honor, Sir Ispan. Have a safe journey to Sasau. The honor is mine, Sir Radzik. Thank you for the hospitality. A long, peculiar history. That was a long time ago. I might tell you about it sometime, but not today. Will you teach me how to use it, like Sir Radzik said? Why? Well, it could come in useful. Maybe I'll travel a bit before settling down. I'd like to know more than the tavern on the green in the forge. 
You know the trouble with an adventurous life, son? It can end before it gets started. I might teach you how to handle a sword, and then someone will shoot you with a crossbow as soon as you set foot outside the house. Mm. Talk as if you've seen it happen. A man my age has seen a lot. Being a blacksmith might bring no glory, but it has its benefits, like keeping your head on your shoulders. I want to end my days in Scalitz, here, beneath the linden tree, and by your mother's side. Well, so do I, one day. But first, I'd like to see the world, meet new people. Meet them, or beat them. Meet. You have to keep going on about it. <laughs> then you've no need to learn swordplay. The dad trying to protect the son. A messenger. He was in a hurry. What's happened? Oh, shit. What the fuck? Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Wait, seriously? We're like a peaceful... Yo. There's no reason to destroy our village, like, with this me- Why? Holy shit. Why? Listen to me, Al. Listen carefully. Take the sword, go into the house, and grab anything else important from the trunk. Go to the castle. Hurry, and what about you? What the fuck, man? Your mother is in the village. I'll fetch her and we'll follow right behind. I'll go with you. No. You do what I say right now. Give the sword to Seretic. If anything happens, he'll take care of you. He owes me. Equals Come evil. On, Hal! You can still make it! Run! This game has a great intro. Good setup. Find a horse! Ride to town, Merc! Tell them what's coming! Warn them! Run by the moats! There's a path down there! Jump down from the wall and flee! I don't think that's Sigismund, right? (laughs) 
Sigismund's people. Right now, the ruler of is um the Weshalol, whatever the fuck guy. His name's weird. Shit, run! Sigismund was some other dude that they mentioned. But I don't know who the fuck that was, man. We out. Guys, run! They're just walking. Do you not see the smoke? Oh my god. There's horses there. No one gives a shit. There's more horses here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Help to re uh, Teresa get away from her attackers. What? Uh, oh god. Did you not see my sword play? Oh god. Do I have the sword equipped? I do. Wait! I'm dead. I'm fucking dead. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. Yo, tell me this auto saves. Oh, nice. Okay, this time we're gonna actually run instead. Wow. I mean, we could try saving her. That must have been a part of it. Like, I, ha I could- I had to do that. Oh, yeah, no, it does happen. Oh, shit. How the fuck do you do this? I don't even know how you're supposed to do anything there. I guess Teresa's gonna die. Yeah, he never told me how to parry. He just told me how to stab, swing, and chain attacks. Did the whistling do it? I have to go this way anyways. You burn in hell, you animals! Oh shit! Yo, how do I help? Maybe if I mount up, they'll leave her alone? Oh fuck, oh fuck, they're running, they're running. All right, let's go. Yeah. Yeah. to find someone who can help you on bleeding. Oh no. I don't know who I'm gonna find. Left. Talmurg is to the left along the stream. Left along the stream. Run, dude! 
I was wondering if you could turn around. You can turn, you can, I think. Huh. Oh, these guys aren't letting up, dude. This guy's right behind me. Oh, shit. Yeah. Warn the others. They've torn skeletons. <laughs> Don't slow down, dude! Oh no. Horse! Horse! Oh god, his stamina is like gone. Yeah! Dude, he has no stamina. Oh no. No, 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 no. Uh, he hasn't even tried shooting another arrow. Oh, to Talmberg. <laughs> oh, shit. Hey, everybody relax. Oh, shit. Yeah. Oh, my God, there it is. Archer, so bad. Motherfucker trained his whole life just to miss on a straight road. Tannenberg's next. Damn. In the morning, we were throwing shit at our guy's house, and now at night, our village is burned down, our parents are dead, <laughs> and I have an arrow in my fucking leg. Someone give him a drink and bring hot wine and bandages. Tell me, boy, who are you, and where are you from? What in hell's name happened? Bro, we're your next-door neighbor. Scouts. They burned it to the ground. Slaughtered everyone. Who? Who burned it to the ground? A huge army. They attacked without warning. And, and they weren't Czechs or Germans either. Who then? I don't know. I've never seen armor like it or heard their language. Maybe Tartars? The sauce? Tartars, you say? Yeah. Well, we'll deal with that later. First, let's have a look at that leg of yours. Who is that? I, I don't know. Grit your teeth, boy. I'm gonna pull that hair out. Yeah! Easy. All done. You were lucky, lad. The arrow missed the bone. It only needed bandaging, and I've done that often enough before. War is a good teacher. Can you stand? Yeah, it's just pulled me There right you go. Up. Good as new. Thank you. If you idlers nothing better to do, get back to work. You'll have to speak to Lord Divish. Can you manage? Lord Divish. Oh, this dude. The Lord of Tannenberg? Sir, this is a survivor from- I heard, Robart. Tell me, boy, what exactly happened? Did you see the insigns of the attackers? And were there any more survivors? 
So um, I don't know what army it was, but it was huge. There were dozens of banners flying on the hill above Scalitz. The ones who did the slaughtering spoke a, a strange language. They burned Scalitz to the ground. But a lot of people took refuge in the castle. I wasn't quick enough. And as I fled, they shouted from the battlements that I should come and warn you. The soldiers the boy didn't recognize. They could be those Cumans of Sigismund's. It said they came to Hungary from the east, and now they're the core of his army. Sacking Gutenberg must have given him a taste for stolen silver. Yeah, you guys Scarlet's should flee Tannenberg. If Sigismund attacks, they can't hold. Indeed, Sir Robard. And our small garrison would be no help, even if we could risk sending them. Do you think we're next in line? Maybe. What's your name, boy? I'm Henry, son of the Scalitz blacksmith. I know him. Did he make it inside the castle? I'm sorry. No! It's in God's hands now. No one else can help us. Anyway, thank you for risking your neck to warn us. Robard, take care of Henry. Make sure he gets something to eat and some rest. Yes, sir. And get all the people inside the gates. We have to prepare for the worst. Make all the necessary arrangements. As you command, sir. Yo, didn't I sell my scarf? Oh my god, the charcoal vendor. No. Yeah, is Bianca dead too? Every, there was a lot of death there. Like the last one. Talk to Sir Robard. Alright. Oh, shit. Yeah, this place is nice, man. Damn. You know, smells like cow shit, but it's all good. It's homey. You've done well, lad. I'm sorry for your loss. You must be all done in. Why don't you go to the kitchen and have a good meal? Sorrow is easier to bear on a full stomach. All right, the kitchen. They say he was a sword who moved to the countryside to make horseshoes. I can't understand why he'd waste his talents, but I'm sure he had his reasons. He had a fine reputation. The kitchen. Ah, milady. You are fortunate our good lady Stephanie of Talmberg has graced us with her presence. My lady, I'm honored. So this is our brave young man. Welcome, lad. Bojena here will take care of you. No doubt you're tired and hungry. <laughs> Indeed. How could he not be, poor soul? After everything he's been through, he must be as hungry as a bear. Aren't you, young master? Bro, oh, everybody already you knows. Are. Eat your fill. And a little wine to wash it down. Has it, is our, isn't this all on the same day? When you're done, you can go and rest with the grooms in the outer valley. No, that won't do, Sir Robard. After all he's been through, he deserves a proper bed. Let him sleep in a lodge in the courtyard. Certainly, my lady. Young Henry here is overwhelmed by your generosity. Oh, yes, yes, thank you, my lady. May God reward you for your kindness. Eat up now. You're in capable hands, so I'll leave you to it. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Just like that. When you've done, you can sleep in the bedchamber of the courtyard lodge. And don't forget to take off those filthy boots before getting into bed. Yo, everybody's so nice here, but like the army is headed in this direction. Whoa! Alright, I'm gonna eat all this roast duck. I just think, um, I'm putting this all in my pocket to then eat in bed. Of course. Yeah, let's just put this. Oh shit, those bed rolls. Sheesh. I mean bread rolls. Sheesh. That cheese. Sheesh. These apples. Sheesh. 
This other, the wine. Don't mind if I do. What she's cooking? I'll just eat this and save the rest for later. And then save the game. Easy. All right, I'm gonna go take a shit and sleep. Um. All right, the lot. Did she say uh, a lodge in the courtyard? Oh, unless it's this room right here. Uh. Hey! Oh yeah, right here? Oh shit, man. I am asleep here. Uh, damn it, I'm hungry. What? You're still hungry? It's all good. Eat this shit. Hey yo, I, I don't see... How do you know? Oh god, how do you know if you're fucking full? I just you I am I'm trying to figure it out. The like these debuffs. Is that a debuff on the right? Or am I still hungry? I want I want those icons to go away, right? Oh, I see. Okay, I, I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay, see, now that will disappear, and now I want to sleep. I don't know what the book means. Oh, yeah, in this game, you choose how long you want to sleep. Nourishment energy. 12 hours, bro. I got shot. I got fucking shot. I'll sleep here. It kind of tells you oh, right there. I got fucking hit with an arrow. Today the patrols will be doubled. Keep your eyes peeled. If you see anything out of the ordinary, report it immediately. Understood. Yes, sir. Oh, yo, my pants and scarf are gone. Nice. Yes. It is I, Henry. Forgive the intrusion. I didn't wake you, boy. Did I? More food? My lady, uh, um, no, no, not at all. But what brings you here at this hour? I thought you could do with a little wine. It's just what you need to help you sleep. This lady's too nice. My lady, um, thank you. My lady. You really shouldn't. You could have sent a sermon. I was going to, but to tell you the truth, I couldn't sleep either. I thought of you while saying my prayers. How awful it must have been for you. I came to offer you solace, to let you know you're not alone. Thank you. Thank you kindly. You're welcome. Now, Henry. I know this is all very new and strange for you. Oh, but fuck? I want you to feel at home here. You're not to worry about anything except getting better. God knows you've been through a terrible ordeal. I know what it is to be left alone in the world. Although your loss is much greater. But with God's help, the pain will ease in time. And it can help to talk about it, if you feel like it. Lady, it hasn't even been 24 hours, okay? I just can't... T whatever, just tell the story. You might be right, my lady. I'll tell you what happened. It was terrible and unexpected. The day started just like any other. Father sent me into town on some errands. Uh... Wait, what's going on here? A fellow by the name of Kunish owed money to Father, who sent me to collect it from him. Only Kunish had no intention of paying. It got a bit heated, as often happens. Did it bug? He's on the right. But Kunish still wouldn't cough up the coin. Father was too generous for his own good. Letting even a scoundrel like that buy on credit. Oh. 
When I'd done all the errands, oh. I headed back home. I promised Father I'd help him with his work, and I was looking forward to it. He was forging a sword for Sir Radzi. Me and Father talk about life. Sir Radzi came to look at the sword. The sword was taking shape when Sir Radzi himself came to have a look at it. He praised Father's work and said that with his smithing skills, he could easily make a living in Prague or Vienna. You don't say. But Sigismund's horde was already on the horizon, ready to attack the town. Sigismund's horde? A horde of soldiers was amassed. Pennants flapped in the wind, the armor glinted in the sunlight, and the horses whinnied impatiently. They were waiting for Sigismund to give the command to attack. How awful. And then death descended on Scalitz. I told you guys, wasn't it Sigismund? He just said it was. Father told me to take shelter in the castle while he went to get mother. She was stranded in the town, surrounded by Sigismund butchers. And then I saw him knocking down one cumin after another. I never saw him fight like that. But then the leader of Sigismund's raiding party, a knight in full armor, saw father and charged at him. I cut down my father without a thought. And then he turned on my mother. And he murdered her in cold blood. You poor boy. May the Lord have mercy on their souls. I ran to the castle like our neighbors to take cover, but I didn't make it. I had to find another way to save myself. The men on the battlements called down to me to flee to Talmberg and warn you. I was lucky I knew a concealed path around the castle. I needed a horse. I needed a horse to get to the safety of I'm just doing of all the heart ones. The and with all that was happening, you thought of others like a good Christian. Then I heard a scream. It was Teresa, the mill wench. She'd been caught by a gang of cumin savages who planned to violate her. I had Sir Radzik's sword, and even though there were several of them and they were better armed, I had to try and save her. I wanted there to be at least one person I'd helped. And I succeeded, even though it almost cost me my life. After that, I stole a horse from them and rode off. Like a valiant knight. I'll never forget the horror. It will haunt me for the rest of my life. Okay. That's terrible. How could something like that happen? Because we're in fucked up times, God lady. Knows why he let such things happen. Oh, you poor boy. I understand your grief, but God is not to blame for the ills of this world. That is the work of Satan and those who do his bidding. Those who are corrupted by greed, envy, and pride. You must not lose faith, whatever life brings. Fate has not been merciful to me and my husband either. Although in comparison to the horrors you went through. I was young when I married my husband. It was my father's wish. Divish was a lot older than I, but a woman must bear her lot. Shortly after our marriage, before I even got a look at Talmberg, the castle was stormed and my husband was imprisoned. Really? My husband had some quarrel with Sir Havel Medek of Valdek, who decided to resolve it by force. He stormed the castle, burned down the village of Pribislavitz, and killed many of our men, even the old Chamberlain. He imprisoned my husband in the castle and put his own garrison there. That's awful. Okay. I was barely 18 years old and all of a sudden, I was left alone with Sir Robert. We didn't know what to do. We went to Prague to appeal to the king and sought help from Divish's friends, but all to no avail. We tried for years, but it seemed I was destined to be left alone and my husband to rot in jail in his own castle. Years, you say? Seven years. That's how long it took before Havel was condemned as an enemy of the crown. And even then, he refused to surrender the castle and release my husband. In the end, I raised the money to pay a ransom. And only then, by the grace of Lord Jesus, did I finally lay eyes on my husband once more. Seven years. And was Havel punished for it? Never. 
And after seven years, my husband returned to me an infirm old man. Sir Divish seems like a good, strong man. Well, certainly, only he has many concerns. He had to rebuild Talmberg. After he was released, the king appointed him Burgrave of Prague Castle, and he was very busy. He had no time for me at all. Lady, she is but dumping we all this in information. Um, there was something going on. This is like kind of random. And now, we're here. My lady, you're still young. And My lady, I'm the main character. Beautiful. Your best years are still ahead of you. Would that that were true, lad. Would it were true. But what am I doing bothering you with this? You have troubles enough of your own. I'll go and let you sleep. I didn't even eat what you brought. I enjoyed our little talk, Henry. Good night and God bless. Good night, my lady. Good night, my lady. Okay. Oh God. He's gonna wake up and it's gonna be like. <gasps> come on, come on, I'm running out of time. Never mind. Wake up. You don't want to miss this. What is there? What's happening? Come to the battlements. One of our patrols reported a company heading here from Skelets. God damn those shoes. Lockpick? Very easy. Oh, I don't have a lockpick. God damn. It's fucking downpour. I don't have shit on. Yo, this looks great at night. Go to the bat and talk to Captain Robard. Holy, look at this castle wall. Oh, yo. No umbrella? Hey, oh, yeah, the men down invented? there. Tell the people outside the walls to prepare for attack. Quickly, do you understand? What's going on? What's going on? I don't know. It doesn't make sense. Why would Sigismund advance on Talmud in the night? Especially since he's lost the element of surprise after the raid on Scalitz. Maybe it's not him. Then who is it? The scouts give his scent to Scalitz, the spy on Sigismund. Said he'd set up camp and was getting ready to storm the castle. And Sir Radzig is an experienced soldier. He'd surely hold the castle for quite some time. It doesn't make sense. What else did the spy say? Not much of anything. Before they could get close enough, this huge storm started. And you were right. Sigismund has a hell of a lot of soldiers, including all manner of mercenaries. An army like that costs a fortune. Well, anyway, we'll find out when they get here, won't we? Aye, we will. Oi. Who is that? Who's out there? It's a group. Oh! Who goes there? Lucifer and all his minions! Who else, Rubber? Sir Antig. What a relief. Is his lordship there with you? Yes, sir. He is right here. 
Oh, what are you shit. doing up so late, Divish? At your age, you need a good night's sleep. <laughs> well, Rantic, you didn't exactly pick the best time for an outing either. In a big hurry? It was a bit of a scramble, all right. Believe it or not, this Tempest is a godsend for me and my men. As my old granddad used to say, better a sore throat than a slit throat. I don't I'd trust that guy. Father was a wise man. Your messenger told us what happened. Messenger? The lad you sent to warn us. He's alive? He made it to you? He's here with me. He only got away by the skin of his teeth, though. Right. God, a brave young man. But tell me, friend, how on earth did you manage to get away? Thank God for this tempest. When it began, Sigismund's Tatars crawled into their holes and left a storm in the castle for more clement weather. We were able to sneak out right under their noses. The Lord be praised. We wouldn't have stood a chance against them. Would you like to spend the night in Tumber? No, no. When Sigismund finds the castle empty tomorrow, he might come looking for us. We'd only be exposing you to danger. Without me and my men, he has no call to attack you. Well, what will you do then? We'll march to Ratai. It's only a short way, and there we'll have a better chance of defense and enough room for all of these people. If Sigismund should come, better bend your knee, Divish. There's no point dying in a battle that's futile. You're right there. Is that boy still with you? Yo. I'm here, sir. You have courage, lad. That I can't deny. I am sorry about what happened. Would you care to join us? I'd like to, sir, but first I have to return to Skalitz. Are you mad? What do you want there? I return. can't leave my mother and father. I won't leave their corpses rotting in the street. I'll join you once I've taken care of them. Don't even think of going back there, you donkey. Are you tired of living? But sir! Quiet! I'm sorry about your father, but getting killed as well won't help him. Divish? Make sure that lad doesn't budge from Talmberg until things quieten down. Not to worry, friend. Anyway, he's injured and needs to recover. I'll lock him up here as if he were Havel of Baldic. Damn. I see you've grown They're a like thick soaking. skin since your tribulation, sir. But thank you. We'll meet again when circumstances are more Everybody's drenched. favorable. Farewell. Farewell, friend. And good fortune. Give my regards to Sir Hanish. I will. And good luck to you and your people, too. These are dark times. Move out! Anywhere, people! Move out! Now. He's still gonna go back. Men, tonight we'll have triple patrol. Sort out the watches between you as always. And if I catch anyone boozing, playing dice, or slacking off, I'll personally break every bone in his body. Yeah. I want you to keep a close eye on everything nearby. Sigismund will surely have sent spies, and likely men as well, to follow the Scalas people now he knows they've fled. Keep your eyes peeled and report everything to me at once. Understood? Wow, they didn't even say yes, sir. They just fucking left. Henry! I need to have a word with you. Sure, man. Can I be of help? And can we get the fuck out of the rain? What is it you need? I could use an extra pair of eyes, and yours are keen. Will you keep watch of the battlements with my men? Is that a request or an order? I'd rather it was a request you answered yesterday. Of course I'll help. I have to pay you back somehow after all you've done for me. Splendid. And don't worry. I'll tell the men to relieve you later. Give Lord watch over you. Splendid. Let's talk to Sir Robard. Keep watch on the battlements. Yeah, this looks crazy here, man. Yeah, I need a quest marker. If there's no quest marker, I'm lost. Do I just stay here? Is he telling me to literally stay here? Fuck it, I'll eat an apple. Mm. 
Mmm, nothing like four apples. Can I take what? this? Oh shit, sorry. What's in here? Shield with Talonberg crest. Uh, Wandering around like a stray sheep. Must be your first watch, eh? What the I don't hell? think anything much will be happening today. You can just lean against the wall and wait till morning. I'll show you what's what. I will. Thank you. Okay, man. Thanks. Wait until morning. Two hours. 6 a.m., three hours. Oh, let's go! Move it! Oh, shit! Go, go! What happened? Let's go! Let's go! Move it! I was sleeping! Go, what happened? Go, go. Oh, God, I'm gonna follow this guy. Go to the battlements of the Outer Bailey. Uh-oh. Sigismund. See how the self-appointed king wins the love and respect of his loyal subjects. Indeed, Robard. Sigismund of Luxembourg has a rare talent for winning people over to his cause. You may be in for a surprise. I don't think he will set his heathen dogs on us today. Greetings, Lord of Tomberg. <laughs> One arrow. The bastard who let the attack of Scullis and kill my parents. Don't be an idiot. Do you want to end up like them? I am Sir Mark Vart von Aulitz. I come in the name of Sigismund of Luxembourg, King of Hungary and Croatia, who has resolved to strike against those who disrupt Concord in the land and to restore order in the name of his brother, King Wenceslaus IV. Restore order by burning and pillaging the king's estates. Greetings, Sir Mark Vart. The efforts of the king's brother to bring order to this chaotic land are undoubtedly noble. It seems to me, though, that he and his army have somewhat strayed. As Burgrave of Prague Castle, Mark Fart. I am entirely beholden to the king. And here in Townburg, divine peace reigned until your arrival. To what then do we owe the honor of your visit? Yesterday, his majesty took action against the enemy of the kingdom. The Ratzik Kobila, who has been using the silver from the Skalitz mine to fund insurrection against the crown. Unfortunately, the insurgent escaped. Would you happen to know, noble sir, where he might be at this time? As far as I know, the Sir Radzik of which you speak is the king's hetman at Skalitz. I find it hard to imagine that he would rebel against our king. Nevertheless, I can assure you that Sir Radzik is not at Talmberg. He would be a fool indeed to flee from one castle, where he has little chance of defense, to another, where he has even less. Or do you take the view that my humble manner is any obstacle to your army? Am I to inform the king then that Sir Radzik Kobila is not at Talmberg? and that he has your loyalty. Sir Radzig Kobila is not here, and I have no intention of getting embroiled in affairs from which I have nothing to gain. Um. Very well, sir. As you wish. I will relay Success. your words to the king in the hope he will be as well disposed as you seem to be. 
those who have clean consciences and good will may find themselves well disposed even at moments like this, when there is little cause for joy. Farewell, sir. Auf Wiedersehen. Damn, they would they would have fucked us up. That guy's a cool villain that they made though. He's he has a he has like a good villain vibe to him. Bury your loved ones, talk to Sir Robard, get a horse. Oh wait, I'm gonna bury them? Alright, shit, I need a horse too. And then what am I doing? Talk to who? Talk to Sir Robard. God be with you. What is Sigismund after? What happened in Gutenberg? Gutenberg? Well, I'm just a simple soldier, but the good Lord gave me ears, and I've heard some things from Sir Divish and from those who fled from Sigismund's pillaging. Were there many? Indeed, but it was the Gutenberg mercenaries who came to see me, because I knew them from before. I see. Listen, lad, these are all games of the high aristocracy. In Prague, a cabal of nobles rebelled against King Wenceslas, wealthy aristocrats who took against our king for reasons of their own. There's no doubt Sigismund had his fingers in the whole affair, him and Wenceslas's cousin, Jobs. And that cabal helped him abduct the king. So then why did Sigismund attack Kuttenberg? Why do you think? Ah, uh, he was afraid of the Kuttenberg insurgent lords to feed his troops from their granaries for the loot. Strategic position and strong fortifications, obviously. I suppose, because it has a strategic position and good fortifications, so it can be used as a base for raids, giving you control of the whole territory and good defences too, if, if you need them. <laughs> Not at all. Come on. King Charles, may God grant him eternal glory, built Prague into a proper royal city, while King Wenceslas took a liking to Kutenberg. After Prague, it's the most important city in Bohemia, in the entire Holy Roman Empire. He who commands the Kutenberg silver is king. So Kutenberg sided with Wenceslas because he favored it. Now you're starting to understand. When Sigismund imprisoned Wenceslas and took control of Prague, the people of Kutenberg began to raise an army against him. So with the attack on Kutenberg, Sigismund killed two birds with one stone. He defeated Wenceslas's most powerful allies before they could stand against him and also gained immense wealth. Mm, I have to get to Scalitz. So, Robard, I need to get to Scalitz. What would you do there, lad? Sigismund might have left, but the place will be swamped with robber barons, brigands, deserters, and other vermin. And anyway, your lord commanded you to stay here. Fuck. If you wear my shoes, you do the same. So, Robard, my parents died there. I can't leave them to be eaten by dogs. What would you do in my place? Sorry, lad, but I won't Hell. take orders. You'll have to wait until everything settles down and maybe your lord will change his mind. Okay, what do you know about the Cumans? What did Sigismund raids? Why did, Why did Sigismund burn down Scalitz and then come here too? That's war for you, lad. Certain lords have resolved to take things into their own hands and eliminate anyone who doesn't share their view. Unfortunately, Sir Radzig is one of those. And what's more, he was sitting on a pile of silver that could help King Wenceslas's allies. All right, let's go. Okay. 
Burry, get out of the castle, get a horse. All right, I guess we're just gonna fucking leave. We can always come and take shelter here at the castle. Anyway, you said yourself you don't believe a word Vilma says. So stop working yourself. Alright guys, peace. I'm gonna exit the castle here. Hopefully I don't break my leg doing this. Let me save the game. Oh shit. I love to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. Alright, I can't exit that way. We gotta exit a different way. Steal a horse? Oh my god, this is the way out. Oh, you're actually, you're kind of stuck here, huh? Oh, this is the innards. I'm pretty sure where I was is how I'm supposed to get out. This is, oh, right here. This is the outer wall. Hey, y'all, open up, dude. Good day to you. I need to get out of here. I need to get out of here. And I need a feather bed with a comely wench in it. But it looks like we'll both be disappointed. Sir Divish gave orders not to open the gate. And you especially are not to be let out. Okay. Don't you know who I am? Let me out, I say. Don't you know who I am? Someone is about to lose his teeth if he doesn't get lost quick. Fuck. I have to bury my parents. My mother and father were left in scallops like carrion. I have to bury them. I can't leave them to the dogs. I'm sorry, my friend, oh, but shit. I can't. Oh, wait. You'll have to persuade Sir Robard, or think something up so I don't end up in the shit for it. Otherwise, forget it. What have you got in mind? What am I supposed to think up? How should I know? Maybe some disguise so I could say I didn't recognize you? If a Townberg soldier turns up all kitted out properly, in armor and a helmet, then of course I let him go. That's obvious. All right, I'll have a look around for something. Okay. I'll be with you. Above the gate, the guardhouse above the gate. Wait, is A uh, marking? What is A marking? Yeah, let's get the armor, fuck it. We'll get the armor. We'll do it. We'll do it. We'll do it. Oh, is it? The, is this in this there? Oh, yeah, it is. Wait, I don't have a lockpick. Shit. I wonder if there's a vendor that has a lockpick, or maybe I can find one. There's got to be a trader in here that has a lockpick. Long distance arrows. Kill a guard and steal his armor? Yeah, you don't want to do that in this game. God damn it! Next to the guard you just talked to. What about... What? There's a lockpick next to the guard I just talked to? Oh, there's a vendor? Oh, maybe this house? Or uh, the other? This guy? Jesus Christ be praised. Jesus Shall Christ be praised. If you've got the coin. <laughs> Jesus Christ be... 14.5, buddy. Are you kidding? Are you fucking kidding? Alright, good thing I looted the schnapps. How much is this gonna get me? 23? What was the deal? Scammed? If you've got the coin. If you've got the coin. Alright, nice. I can haggle, but whatever. Wait, oh, schnapps? You, oh, schnapps are saves? Every time I save, I use a schnapp? Are you for realsies? Oh, I'm gonna fuck this up. What the hell do you even do here?
I'm not gonna read that. I'll figure it out. Hey, what are you doing poking around in that lock? This definitely won't come cheap. You learn crime doesn't pay. No. Watch it, I serve the Lord of Ratte. Oh, come on, my friend. You know I'm in the service of Sir Radzig Cobbler, don't you? Try your fairy tales on someone else. Fuck. That much? I don't have enough on me. You don't pay, you go to jail. Come on, man. Put me in jail, then. Just the accommodation for you. Get moving. And since I trust you as much as I trust, well, a thief, I just search you to be on the safe side. Better hand over the loot now. God damn it. I hope you enjoyed your time in our little establishment. <sighs> Not much, actually. Glad to hear it. And can I go? Go? Ah, you can, I'm sorry to say. Now bugger off and get yourself killed for all I care. Oh, and... That's how you do it right there, boys. Alright, let's go save Dad and Mom. Now we go back. Where the fuck was I? Oh, shit, that's how far it was? Oh, my God. Okay, this seemed way closer. Alright, I need a horse. No horse, no armor? I think I'll just find a horse. No, I'll find a horse. It's all good. There's probably a horse around here I can just grab. As in just like steal the horse. Yeah, how do I read what the debuffs are, by the way? How do I see what my debuffs are? Oh, right here. Released prisoner. Oh, that's it. Wait, yeah, can I just fast travel? How does the fast travel even work? You can't fast travel just now. That's the game's way of telling me that I'm supposed to walk. I feel quite hungry. I feel quite hungry. Am I even going the right way? Where the fuck am I? Oh, I see myself. Okay. Yeah, actually, maybe it's worth uh, loading up and lockpicking, getting the gear and doing it up. What do you guys think? I could load up and do it and just close the door this time and try to actually lockpick. Where did it start from? Uh, I have no idea. Shh. What time is it? 57. Yellow is manual save. Oh. Oh yeah, we're right here. Is this before or after the lockpick? Good date. Can we trade? If you've Can we trade? Still gonna just sell one of these. Two of these. Can we trade? If you've got the coin. Chat, we'll get more. Relax. Okay. Look out. Oh. oh, yeah, that was the guy that caught me last time. Okay.
Oh, wait. Oh, that's how you do it. Interesting. Hey! You've no business here. Clear off or you'll be sorry. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, I don't know if he noticed. Did he notice? He noticed, but like, not at the same time. I'm gonna stay down here. What was that noise? Oh! I could do with a bite to eat. Bro, this is not the time for food, buddy. Oh, he left. He left. Saved. What? When I find him. What the fuck? Help! Help! How am I drunk? When the fuck did I even drink? I think I must have used it in my inventory by accident. Is he Diagra eventually? We're gonna find out. Oh god. I'll slaughter you. To reload chat I have to don't I Yeah, but if I'm wearing this shit, I don't think they'll know. Yeah, what are you talking about? I just look like a regular soldier. Am I drunk still? Alright, where am I gonna get a horse from? Where am I gonna get a horsey from? Mark my words. I don't think there's horses. Mm. Oh, wait, yeah, weren't there horses over here to the right? Yeah. Hey, yo. Oh, shit, yo. Divish's horse? Mount and steel. Yo, no way. I can't even save right now. It doesn't let me. I'll have to get something to eat. I'm starting to get hungry. Mm. This doesn't seem right. Oh, wait, this is my horse. Oh, that would have been bad. Yeah. Yo, open that shit. Let me talk to this guy now. Good day to you. Um. I need to get out of here. Says who? I've never seen you before in my life. And that's odd, seeing as how you're wearing our colors. 
fuck. You're holding up Sir Divish's messenger. Cut the horse shit and let me out. You're not here to ask questions. Or would you like Sir Robard to find out you're holding up Sir Divish's messenger? Yeah. Oh, all right. All oh, right. Oh, shit. God be with you. Oh, shit. All right. God be with you. Oh, my God. Jesus. God be with you. Ugh. Yeah. All right. Let's go to Scarlet's. Yo, how long does this drunk shit last? On the right way. I am. Yeah. Yeah, we gotta we gotta go. Yeah. Yeah, the snake the saves are bound to the snaps. That's kinda random. Yeah, sure, I guess I could sleep. Quest completed, run. Oh. Yeah. You'll have to wait for me here, friend. Better to keep going on my own. Oh shit, he's already here. This is a bad idea. I'm still fucking drunk, dude. Find your parents. Yeah, this rain looks crazy. Are we here yet? Oh, I'm in Robna, so I have to actually um, walk there west. And I'm hungry. Maybe if you eat, you sober up a little bit. Mercy kill. What did he have? Trash. We don't want that shit. Shit stained leather jerkin. You cannot delay. I really should sober up. Alright, we're gonna run there. Oh, God. 